एवरीवन एंड माय दिस पर्टिकुलर वीडियो इज रिलेटेड टू सम ऑफ द न्यू कोर्सेज बीइंग इंट्रोड्यूस्ड दिस एकेडमिक सेशन इन सम आई एंड वेन एवर सम न्यू कोर्सेज आर इंट्रोड्यूस्ड देन इट इज ऑलवेज इजी टू एंटर इन टू दोज कोर्सेज ओनली थिंग इज यू शुड प्रिपेयर रियली वेल फॉर दोज कोर्सेज एस्पेशली इफ देर इज अ इंटरव्यू अनदर थिंग आई वॉन्ट टू टेल यू इज लाइक वेन एवर अ न्यू कोर्स इज इंट्रोड्यूस्ड द रीजन टू इंट्रोड्यूस न्यू कोर्सेज that market may there is a demand for that industries has demand for that particular course otherwise you know iits iics they will not introduce any new course if its demand is not there so that means if new course is introduced certainly you should apply for that and you should try to get into that course and the mentors of your pda will help you and um, guide you how to get into these new courses today in my this video i'm going to tell you uh, about the new courses being introduced in iic bangalore and iit kanpur in fact uh, mentors of your pda gave this information about the courses of iit kanpur 3 months back that these courses will be introduced and now the official statement has come for that now this particular mobility engineering mtech in mobility engineering this is the new course introduced in iic bangalore and uh, you know the selection process is through aptitude test and interview process as you know your pda gives you extensive uh, post gate uh, guidance in that you know preparation for this aptitude test and uh, interviews and research proposal uh, statement of purpose etc is all included so you can prepare really well for these kind of uh, new courses being introduced with the mentors so departments uh, involved in uh, mobility engineering are these departments so you can see the departments electrical engineering you know these departments artificial uh, i think this uh, aeronautical engineering department is also involved in this civil engineering so these are the cpdm center for product development i think that is also involved so these departments are involved in uh, mobility engineering course seven uh, is the intake and qualification required btech can be in you know aerospace engineering civil engineering maybe chemical computer science electronics electrical instrumentation mechanical production xc so uh, i think this is metallurgy or i don't know this is mt is the course also there selection process 70% gate weightage and 30% interview area of studies uh, hybrid and electric vehicle so who does not know the value of this and uh, you know this mechatronics so hybrid and electrical vehicle so those of you who want to pursue career in electric vehicles mechatronics and all this is the new course but Uh, despite of the call you will get it there will be interview there will be written exam or something start preparation for this it is always easier to get into these kind of courses so mobility engineering is something which is good mobility engineering think of mechatronics okay semiconductor technology is the another uh, uh, you know uh, course which iic has come out with and uh, it is under the department of nano science and engineering so you can see the students of electronics electrical instrumentation mechanical they can go into this and uh, they can uh, join this particular course again 30% is interview and 70% weightage is of the gate score area of the studies they have mentioned in detail so mems biosciences so all these are very very you know uh, industrially relevant courses and uh, you should try to get into uh, as you know semiconductor industry is a booming industry so again you should try to get into this so you can start your preparation for this then there was a cutting of newspaper cutting of the director of iit kanpur uh, professor abhay so he was telling about the importance of unmanned air vehicle system and drone technology and uh, ministry of electronics and information technology you know has taken this initiative so yes now uh, there is a new course being introduced uh, in the design and uh, aero mechanics of unmanned air vehicles or this course is introduced so they have introduced two courses related to you know unmanned air vehicles so that information is there uh, though it is not on the website of iit kanpur because forms are still to come out but two new mtech programs unmanned air vehicle uh, domain and cognitive system engineering so cognitive system engineering is another way to enter into computer science domains where you can pursue courses like you know artificial intelligence machine learning data science all these things are part of cognitive system engineering and in some places cognitive science as a course is there so those of you from core branches and want to get into cognitive science or these domains which i told you is a great opportunity start your preparation 
so learning modules are already available on the panel of your PDI you can learn from there and you can plan your uh, you know uh, selection into these kind of departments so as I told you earlier also this next couple of months please don't waste and maximize your gate score that means whatever gate score you have get the best out of this so that when you get the placement you get the best placements in those particular courses whenever new course will be introduced the reason for that will be okay this course is highly required course in the industries and there's a demand in the industries for this course and try to get into that and the process to get into that mentors of your PD will tell you thoroughly mentor you prepare you thoroughly for that so don't miss those chances also unmanned air vehicle uh, and drone technology is fast coming up technology and uh, during our visit in IIT Mandi the director of IIT Mandi uh, he uh, informed us that yes uh, drone technology with the government of Himachal Pradesh IIT Mandi is uh, planning big for drone technology unmanned air vehicle domain maybe the course will be there in IIT Mandi also if it is not there soon there will be course so this particular thing if you see uh, they have already mentioned that you know government of Uttar Pradesh is supporting the center of excellence of uh, you know in drone at IIT Kanpur similarly government of Himachal Pradesh is also pushing ahead with the drone technology because Himachal also surveillance will be very easy in that particular part of India so keep watching your PDA and keep getting the detailed information about the new courses what are the new courses and don't miss joining the new courses or applying in new courses because the probability of selection is maximum there and the job opportunities are the best in new courses all the very best and look forward to mentor you for selection into various courses thank you